What's up, y'all? It's your girl Shantia, and I'm back with another banger, another word, okay? Now, listen, y'all, I got a word for y'all today. But first, I just want to remind you all that if you haven't gotten your tickets to the First Class Summit, make sure that you go grab them by visiting the First Class Summit dot com okay listen vip is still almost sold out i think we only have like um 10 vip left or something so make sure you go get your tickets make sure that you're in the building okay um baby god gonna blow our mind with this one okay but anyways y'all so let's get straight into the word so um the title for this video is miracles on miracles okay miracles on miracles and so all of this week um god has just been speaking to me and the rest of this month on um miracles happening suddenly okay and swiftly and so about a week ago i was driving and i don't know if i was in prayer and worship or god was speaking to me i don't know but it was something and i look over to my right and i see a license plate with a rainbow on it right and i'm like okay you know i started laughing i haven't seen a rainbow in a minute and so um I seen the rainbow and then I kept driving. And so I got home and God had told me um, to go look at my content of videos, okay? And literally as I'm scrolling, y'all, I'm not even looking at my phone, I'm scrolling. It was like, boom, my thumb specifically landed on a video, okay? That was talking about miracles and it had a rainbow on it. And so in that moment, I just began crying because God was just speaking to me. And then not just a second confirmation, but a third confirmation, I had a dream about, okay, the rainbow and the colors. And so God led me to scripture, okay, when he was just talking about miracles on miracles. And he led me to Genesis 9, verse 12 and 13. And it says, then God said, I am giving you a sign of my covenant with you and with all living creatures for all generations to come. I have placed my rainbow in the clouds. It is the sign of my covenant with you in all the earth, okay? And so we all know, and if you don't know, that a rainbow is a sign from God, okay? And a covenant a covenant is his promise to us, okay? And so this um, passage specifically was talking about um, God blessing Noah, okay? And um, when God was sp speaking to me on um, miracles and miracles, and you know seeing signs and wonders you know all over the place god was not all just speaking about the miracles that he's doing in our life but also saying that you are the miracle that you're looking for now let me tell y'all how god um confirmed this so for the past week god has been telling me to watch the movie milan when i was a little girl pocahontas and milan were my one of my two um favorite movies that i used to watch on repeat okay well my best friend had told me that milan now has a live and action movie where it's like real people okay i've never seen it before and so i went to go watch it yesterday and as I'm watching a movie, okay, if you go back and watch Disney movies, a lot of the 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 um, meaning behind the movies, child, listen, <laughs> it be deep. And so as I'm watching Milan, um, and you know, Milan had to fight on her family's behalf and she took risks, okay? She took a big risk by going to a battlefield that she knew nothing about. Um, it, it, it was not the norm for a woman to go into the battlefield. And so, but anyway, she ended up sneaking out the night, going to battle, ended up defeating the battle. But there was a point in the movie where um, she got into this fight with this other woman, which was a witch, okay? And um, in that moment, the, the boy or the person that she was portraying to be during that time had died. And Milan had resurrected, okay? The real version of her has resurrected, okay? And that's for somebody. And in this season, whatever person that you're portraying to be, whatever person or mask that you're trying to put on or trying to, to, to allow people to think one thing, but you're really not it. God is saying it's not gonna work in this season. And so Milan was raised up in that moment. And she went back to go to tell the people, you know, that she was a girl and she was fighting on her family's behalf and guess what the people had two options either they was gonna accept her or they weren't okay and so at first of course they didn't accept her they rejected her but at the end of the day when you do something that is so grand when you do something that is 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 life-changing and she had literally saved all of their lives okay and won the battle and defeated the battle and so when you do something that no one has ever done before 
when you are full of so much purpose and you're saving people's lives and you're changing people's lives and mindsets and whatever the case is, they have no choice but to respect you for being who you are. And so that's what happened to Milan. At first, they couldn't accept her, but then it came down to the point where they're like, well, she was the only one who defeated this battle. She was the only one who had insight on what was going on or the things that we were blind to. She was the only one that could do X, Y, and Z. And because God has called you to be the one to see things that your family and, 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 and your friends have not seen before, because God has called you to be the one to do things that nobody around you has done before, that means that you're going to have to step into confidence in this season. My God, God said, I'm placing upon you a certain type of confidence that no man has given and no man has taken away because the places and the spaces that God is giving you, God said, not only am I going to present miracles on miracles for you, but God said, I'm going to make you a miracle. You're going to be the miracle that somebody else is praying for. You're going to be the miracle that you have been looking for. My God, you're going to be the miracle that walks into the room. You're going to be the miracle that that person that that business that 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 um um group does not forget about listen child and so in that moment she did something that's never been done before she did something that's never been seen before it wasn't the norm for a woman to go fight in a battle but yet she tore everything that was up against her and her family and her people she tore it down by being authentically her and using the strength and using the inner warrior that she was designed to be. And so listen, child, <laughs> it went completely in, in, in alignment with what God was speaking to me on miracles and miracles. And so God just wanted me to say that, that this week, this month, this year, is going to be a year full of miracles on miracles. And it's not just going to be God releasing miracles to you and for you, but it's going to be God releasing miracles through you. And the miracles that you're looking for, God said, is he's going to make you become the miracle that you're looking for. Because just like I said in my last video, is what you're looking for is looking for you too. So the miracles that you're looking for, God said, I'm going to make you become it. Because one warrior knows when it meets another warrior one leader knows when it meets a le another leader one legend knows when it meets another legend and people are going to recognize who you are because you have showed up authentically for who god has created you to be not the false version of you not the version of you that has been trampled on, that has been hurt on, but the version of, of, of who God created you to be, that powerful version of you, that courageous version of you, that version of you that doesn't back down from a fight, that version of you that doesn't back down from a battle, that version of you that doesn't give up, that version of you that continues to push forward, that version of you that continues to seek God, that version of you that continues to elevate and go from glory to glory, that version of you that continues to step out on faith even though you don't have all of the resources and the pieces that version of you because that's the version of you that God has created you to be a warrior okay anyways I pray that you all can receive this blessed and prosperous word and know that you're about to see miracles 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 on miracles that you could have never imagined God is not a man that he shall lie. And in his word, he said that I swear I'm going to bless you. And you're about to see the promises that God has already promised you were to come to pass. And they're already coming to pass, child. Some of us just need to open up our eyes to the new, okay? But anyways, I pray that you all have a beautiful and blessed day. Make sure to go get your tickets at thefirstclasssummit.com. I love you all and I will see you all next time. Bye.